Hello, this is Lorena, and I'm here to ask, is maintenance over yet? I will assume it is because I hear the music. Also, I would like to show off my new avatar. Yes, Vroid Studio recently released a full version. Um, basically, I was using the beta version. They just released the first version for Vroid Studio. So now it's official. It's out. It's professional-ish. Yeah, the options are still a bit limited. But I think my Vroid avatar looks much, much better. And the first full version being out, well, there, there's room for them to, there, there's room for improvement. So I look forward to future, to future releases for Vroid Studio. So hopefully I can really make a good avatar. Now this one looks better than my last one. I, I will tell you that. You know what I do? You, you know what I do by now. Okay, what kind of... Um, dude, imagine who would... Dude, this is just... First off, the options... One arc, two arc, five names. First off, if you've never watched arc five, you would automatically know the choice. Um, I mean, a lot of these are just obvious. Um, counter trap. Uh, I'm going to say quick play. They can't all be normal, but... Hmm. Well, I was right. I never did... did. Well, technically, he only... he did, Technically, he did GMUV, but whatever. <laughs> um, which one is right, though? I'm overanalyzing this, I swear. What kind of trap card is this? Um, counter? Okay, well I definitely don't know shit. Um, uh, unacceptable results. I doubt that. Okay, lucky loan. Mm. I don't know, but I, I don't see Carly handing out loans. A am I just wrong? Let's see. Yes, I'm wrong. <laughs> I don't need to be doing this, but I am anyway. Mm. Okay. You got a strike at the bowling out. Dude, this was years ago. How, how am I supposed to remember that? Well, let me think. Who got a strike at the bowling alley? Dude, I don't remember shit about bowling. Um, this is very embarrassing, honestly. What should I do? Uh, let's see. I'm gonna say Joey. Okay, well. Well, God. That's what I get for not knowing shit about bowling. Also, my memory sucks. But I mean, the fact that I haven't watched 
the movie in years. That, that would definitely contribute a lot. Especially since the movie came out when, you know, Arc 5 was airing. <laughs> okay, what is the name of this card? What is this? I have no idea. Um, okay, so that's an Xyz monster. Um... I have no idea. I don't use that archetype. And now I believe that zero is wrong. But what about 2000? Is that right? Or is it this one? I'm gonna pick this. It's wrong. Stop asking me this. I know. Oh god. How many fours is, um, I'm going to say three. Yeah, I pick three because four is considered an unlucky number in Japan. It's sort of like how the number 13 is considered unlucky here in the United States. Although I'm not sure, I, I don't really view the number 13 as unlucky. I don't with the number four either, but you know, what kind of, tr actually, what kind of high school would have bar fours anyway? What, what, what? It, okay. Well, this is definitely awkward. I might end up getting a 70-something, maybe a 60-something. But, but I'm doing this for fun. What type is this card? Um, this one, I have a decent chance of getting this wrong. I'm split 50-50 on whether or not that's a zombie. It could easily be a fiend. Now, when I look at this... I get fiend vibes more than zombie vibes. I was wrong. <laughs> um, okay. Well, I have not heard of Avatar family or Grenor family at all. Like, what? What? Are you serious? Like, seriously. I, I think anyone will get this right. What is the item that lets you receive packs? But okay, hold on. Okay, um, I believe it's this. I am so t what? Okay, um, uh. Okay, well, I have no idea then. Probably the first one. How many years did it take Yugi to put together the Millennium Puzzle? Um, I answered this at one point. And I'm like, I have no idea. And the last time, I believe I got it right. But since then, I have completely forgotten what I picked last time. Six, two... I believe I may have picked six. No, I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. Okay, what was jo Why would I know? Um, well, I picked a rice ball last time. I, I remember that. Okay, um, what, what do I think Joey would eat for lunch? I think he would eat a taco. I was wrong. What type is this card? Um, uh, hold on. Um, yes, I have to look at that and see what vibes am I getting from this card? 
<laughs> which archetype do I think it's from? I, I mean, which, you know what, I, I, I'm, it's past three. Okay. Uh, you know, the reason I'm on right now is because, I, I mean, if I, if I go to bed right now, I might end up being interrupted. Um, I want to say that's normal. What kind of trap card is this? First off, how, wh what? Dude, how the hell is that even in this game? You need, you need a spell. Okay, Duel Links, how do you make use of this card? I'm so very confused. Because of the way that card is actually used. Okay, um... Which celebration? I have no idea. I just proved it. That I have no idea. What type is this? Oh, I better know. Well, well, I don't actually remember this one. And now when I look at that card, I really... That is... It doesn't look like an animal something machine. <laughs> My memory is bad. Uh-huh. Hey, 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 guys. So, yeah. Cyrus started off in Slifer Red. And this question is just... It, it's making a reference to that. Okay. Which card is related to this card? Um, I had to remember how many times I got my ass kicked. Okay, right off the bat, Kite Tendo is the, is the answer. <laughs> Well, I just looked at these and I'm like, no. I, I mean, I wasn't looking at the screen very well, but I could tell that was Kite. <laughs> and when he, since he was there for the question, I assumed it was like, what is this character's name? <laughs> what, which card is related to this card? Uh, ancient, ho hold on a second. Well, I don't, I don't know. Um, ancient, the door of destiny. Well, I honestly have no idea. But my first guess is ancient tool. Now, uh, I'm between this one and this one. I, I don't know. Well, I got that question wrong. Um, <laughs> what? Oh my god! Okay, what best describes this character? Um... Uh... Bright... Dude, I, I didn't even watch the second half of Five Days. No, I didn't watch it. And I played a game where the second half of this series sort of played a role but i did not actually watch the anime portion of that so what i got to see was just um well it was similar but different because of the way the game was yeah the story was a bit altered just to, just to some degree Okay, what is the name of the packs you can only get through events? Um, what? How would I know? Have I gotten any extra packs? Um, I'm gonna say special pack. I have no idea how I got that one right. Remember how I said I could get a, a low score this time? <laughs> yeah. Now let's see. Let's see. Hold on. Hmm. So, so far that's 
I will need to finish this to actually do the math right. Okay, 20 to 30 cards. Which card is related to this card? What is this? Dude, I can't believe this character showed up. I was thinking about him recently. You know, when I said I didn't watch the second half of 5Ds, but I played a game that sort of went into those details. And so I know who Primo is. Now, do I know all the plot bullshit? Not really. If no one knows who Yugi is by now, like, dude, seriously, this game says a lot. Okay, anyway. Which card is related to this card? Um... Um... I don't know. Okay. Ominous fortune telling was apparently wrong. Um... I... Yeah, I kind of had to... Which event let you... Okay. In Dark Side of Dimensions, what, what you're... What? Okay, well... It's... I'm, I'm going to guess third year. Okay, so I got... The 30s... 72. Alright. Well, I could have tried a bit harder there, but I didn't. <sighs> anyway, let's see what happens now. It took me over 15 minutes to complete that. Embarrassing. Okay, well... What is it? What does this game have to have to bring to the table? Oh, and by the way, I like this avatar so much more than my last one. It looks decent, though obviously I would greatly benefit from, uh, you know, practicing with the tools in VRH Studio and making sure that the background doesn't conflict with my hair. Or the rest of my avatar, for that matter. <laughs> okay. At least this viewer, at least this model looks a bit... It, it looks polished enough. And, and I really like that. I like that I've got an avatar over here with a, that has a model that isn't... It, it looks like some effort went into this. And it doesn't look the way my last avatar did, which was intentional. I pretty much didn't want to, to use that avatar again after a while. <laughs> I kind of hated it. Now, why did I hate it? Well, it's actually very simple. Because I didn't look very good. My model just looks terrible. Now, I'm going to fill you in on a secret. This model isn't really the greatest either. either. There are reasons that... I mean, I should honestly be trying harder because... There are so many problems with this model. Though, for now, this one's good enough. Okay. Uh. 
Well, I'm going to assume that I've already done this. Because I remember the whole four year campaign and I, I was actually very surprised that I was still able to get things from that. But I believe that's where I got Alternative Dragon was from this campaign. So yeah, I think this is not. I think this is done. It's not really new, it's just an extension, that's it. Okay. It doesn't tell me much here. Okay, so the changes... I'm not building a necro... I can't pronounce that. Is that... Dude? Wow, okay. Sure. I might even have that card, to be honest. Okay. There is nothing here. I, I don't see shit. Okay. So what should I do since I can't see shit? Well, honestly... Game- oh, well the tournament ended so I want to see something. The event is now open. Okay. Event code. Duelist Road. The dark side of dimensions. The special area, Duelist Road, the dark side of dimensions, has been unlocked. Let us begin. It is very important. Trust me. Okay. Well, I honestly am not... Well, honest, I'm done being you, Belle, for right now. You know, I was playing as you, Belle, because I sort of resonated with them for a bit. But now I'm sort of normal again. Sort of being the key phrase. I'm not normal, ever. Yes, not normal at all. Now give me a second. Uh, and now, now for National Novel Writing Month, I, uh, I'm, I um gave titles to the protagonists and the rivals, and um, and uh, for Dayton, I, I was just like, his hair is normal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I said his hair is normal. Because it has a hair color that exists in real life. <laughs> also, I would like to remind everyone that... Uh, no, wait, no. I wanted to say one of what I... I wanted to say which one I picked for Yuma because... <laughs> oh, God. So, so, for Yuma, I, I was like... I have 99 problems... But pessimism isn't one of them. <laughs> the titles were hilarious, but I, I, I'm not always hilarious to other people, so I never know if I should say a joke or not. Because what if what if someone doesn't think it's funny? What if what if people think that my sense of humor is just weird? And I, I'm just not funny at all. Yeah, you see the problem, right? It's pretty tragic. Well, if, if you care about being funny, that is. And to be honest, I do. I mean, come on, why wouldn't I want to entertain people? Entertain people and make them laugh. Although preferably without killing anyone. I don't know if you can actually die from laughter, but... I've had a few, I've had a few experiences of wondering 
if I'm going to die. Like, I've had to actually try to stop laughing just to breathe. Man, um, I'm pretty sure I know about all this booze rep, but I just don't give two shits. <laughs> yeah. Nah, to be fair, I don't think Jaden cares either. And now I think when it comes to positivity work, being able to relate to Jaden in a positive way would be very good. Except there's one problem. Yes, one problem. I have anhedonia, so how the hell am I supposed to? <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. Well, technically, I, 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 it's a problem if I don't have certain emotions going on in the background. <laughs> like I have to be experiencing a certain amount of emotional intensity or my body is just it doesn't work and now i got my energy back when i was flipping my shit so that was interesting but also really i i i don't know my body is weird lately and i don't understand it um i accidentally changed windows I don't really think I'm being very nice to you, but thanks. I would love to be considered nice, but kicking your ass in a duel in this particular way, not really being very nice, is it? <laughs> you know, there could be a plot twist. I could lose. Though if I'm really careful, I won't. <sighs> yeah, if I'm really careful. Sure. At least this isn't a tumor deck. I'd be tempted to just turn off auto duel for a tumor deck. <sighs> you know, whenever I see a tumor deck come up, maybe I should just play the duel myself. Although, when I criticize auto duel, it's still like... Yes, but some, some of my mistakes are just as bad. I mean, really, some of them are. Okay. Auto Joe comes up with a lot of combos and a lot of things and a lot of things. Yeah, I've learned some strategies from Auto Joe. Which I think is a great thing. I think it's amazing. Being able to learn, being able to learn things from how the AI use, uses your deck is incredibly interesting. It can, it can, it can, um, it can help you better understand how to use your deck. Anyway, um, I, I have to wipe off my glasses because uh, because I don't clean them much really I don't remember the last time I properly cleaned them I could do it right now but then I'd have to get up and I don't want to leave the video running for too long in a couple videos I did spend a short time not really being here, but that's not exactly something I think should be normal. And I really don't want to make that normal because it, that would pr be pretty bad. Also, which version of Jaden is this? I mean, I know it's uh, pre-season 3 Jaden, but I was just curious what level he is. Yes, the level would be more accurate than the version. <laughs> okay. 
Well, Jaden Jaden beat himself again, so that's nice. I am I am in introvert mode. Yes, that's right. Introvert mode. It, it's a mode where I'm basically I basically have to recharge, but I don't know how I ever recharge anything. As far as I'm aware, I, I, I just get pissed off and somehow my body lately just, it's fine with that. <laughs> now I don't really understand how that works. Now, now if I was in shape, I'd be able to better understand, but I am definitely not in shape. That should change, but I mean, I'm not motivated, and... You're going to regret this. You are going to regret this for your entire life. So you better prepare yourself, because I don't show anyone mercy. No, that's the wrong card. Oh, God. No. Um, if that was a mistake, I did not mean to do that. But, whatever. I will let my pony kick my ass while I do, so do a thing. I'm back. I lost, and that was a disaster. I, I don't think I'm fully here, to be honest. But I was intending to attack the charmer that stole my monster. Instead, I attacked the wrong one. Which was an absolute... It, it was horrifying. I was like, why? Why? I hate doing you, but whatever. I, I don't have to pay any attention to his dialogue afterward, but I, I don't know. The reason that he bothers me is because of his passive aggression. And even then, I can never remember if this is the right, if this is the actual person doing it. Like, is this, is this person known for Passive aggression, or am I getting him confused with a different person? <laughs> I never really know. Okay, well I won. And because I forgot already, let's see what he says. I mean, my memory isn't the most reliable thing out there. And I think we know this already. Give me a second. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that, that's a passive aggression. It's kind of dumb to be passive aggressive. Like, dude, if you're gonna be aggressive, be, be full aggressive. Okay, that's, that's bad advice. Please don't listen to that. You shouldn't be aggressive because you might hurt someone. Yeah. So, so don't do that. Obviously in my videos, it can be very difficult to tell if I actually support doing something or not. Just, just based on my dialogue and how sometimes I can say things without laughing my ass off. Which I think is most of the time. There was like one exception, but when, where was it? When was it? I'm actually wondering when this was. Okay, well I'm pretty sure the, the Supreme King event comes to mind, so I think it was that one. 
And I think I was laughing at what Chaz said. Like he had a problem with the Supreme King's armor, but absolutely no problems with all the other shit he was doing. Okay, of all things to confront the Supreme King about, you hate on his fashion. Sure. Sure, that, that, that sounds logical. And that sounds... That, that sounds normal. Yeah, I too would criticize someone's fashion sense. Even if they went around murdering people, that would be all I had. That would be the only problem I have with them is whether or not they're a fashion disaster or stealing my style. Also, Chaz, shut up. I wear black as much as I want. Anyway, there are definitely... All right. You know, this is really driving home the point I was making earlier about dueling against the Charmers and not clicking auto-duel against them. This is just stupid. But I think the main reason I'm losing against the Charmers is because of how powerful my cards are. And now I don't I don't mean to say that my deck is good. I just mean to say that because of the kind of numbers I'm running with my attacks, they can get they can do a lot of damage just by stealing one monster. And that's it. So my usual strategy just auto dueling is not a good idea. Honestly, even at the very beginning, I think it was a terrible idea to do that. <laughs> but I have developed a serious hatred of Charmers. And now it's not as bad as certain other decks I hate. But it's definitely up there. And by the way, there's only one card archetype. Out of any card game I've played, that just drives me batshit. Of all the cards. It, you know what? I have to call off the entire clan for this. I don't like Nova Grappler from Cardfight Vanguard. <laughs> what, what is my problem with the clan exactly? Well, it kept me from unlocking Cyclovia back in April of this year. And I, w I saw Nova Grappler. Nova Grappler was everywhere. Everywhere. And I was trying to get Cyclalia with Link Joker. And failed. But, but now I feel more connected to my main clan again. So instead of wanting to use Link Joker, I now want to use Shadow Paladin instead. And now this game is weird i'm i'm honestly not sure how i started playing elemental heroes it's like dude why would i forget this why would i forget this and now some cards came from Jaden. some came from free some came from personal decisions but there had to have been a point where I actually got those cards without trying, and I swear I didn't get them all from Jaden, or tickets for that matter. Yeah, I I, I think Jaden is more than worthy. I mean, just saying, he's basically one of the best students at the entire school, and he's only in Slifer Red. And again, I believe he made the choice to stay in Slifer Red. I believe he had an opportunity at one point to move up to Raw Yellow. It's similar to Cyrus, but also my memory sucks, so I don't know if that's my imagination or if that actually was a thing. 
but I lean toward it actually being a thing because a, a duelist as good as Jaden really, well, it doesn't make a lot of sense for him to stay in, for, for him to be in Cypher Ed. Now, his test grades, on the other hand, maybe. I mean, I assume there are written exams. And Jaden probably doesn't study for those. At least I assume he doesn't. I don't really study it either. When I studied anything, it was just like, I studied the wrong information. What I studied never really seemed to help. My grades sometimes even seemed to get worse from doing that. Because I would forget information based on the frequency, based on the frequency, frequency, based on the frequency, I was basically, I, I, when I did study, it was like I lost information based on how often I was studying other information. And I think there's a good reason for this. And it's called, I hate the healthcare system. Um, well, that's true too, but I was cr being critical of the education system. Well, um, interesting, interesting. I didn't know my brain was thinking about healthcare. My brain has some interesting conversations with itself. <laughs> I must be quite honest. No, no, let's start this. Hold on a second. Um, this is 41 minutes. I, I, I can do the, I can do like the episode, the, the first episode, I'll be fine. Okay. Okay, so Joey is like, you got in? That study abroad program's lucky to have you. I have no idea if he's talking to Taya or what. But I do know that Taya wanted to move abroad, so I'm assuming that's to Taya. Can't be afraid to bite off more than I can chew. I know you'll make it for sure. I'm so proud that you're following your dreams, Taya. After I graduate, I have to work at my dad's factory. Man, Tristan, that sucks. It could be worse. <laughs> yeah, it could be. Jo Joey has a pretty dark backstory, if I remember right. I know a guy whose job was being a wrestling dummy. Um, ho ho hold on, hold on. Hmm. Okay, I have no idea here. What? Oh god. Joey is still planning to be a pro duelist after school is over? You better believe it, there's no one who can stop me. Except our teacher when you except our teacher. Except our teacher when you polished her dull disc in class. Okay, I was I didn't wanna I don't know, I, I don't wanna give people the wrong idea, but my, my brain was talking in ways that were, it, it felt a bit inappropriate for me to be talking like that. And no, talking like that isn't bad by any means, but it felt like I was going to offend some people. Now, obviously I overthink all the time, so don't look too far into that. Uh, yeah, you paused your dual disc in class. Uh, dude, if I was the teacher, I would have done the same thing. And the only way you'd get your dual disc back is if your parents came by to pick it up. <laughs> Although it took guts to do it during our final... Dude? Joey, why? You, you don't do that shit during the final exam. Your turn, Yugi. Tell the guys what your game plan is. Uh, sure. Why not? 
I'm going to start creating my own games. I wish I had the inspiration to uh, do something a bit similar, just in a more written format. And maybe one day we'll all be able to play one together. That would be lovely, Yugi. Yeah, so now that Bukhar is no longer possessed, when... Um, that's a typo. I had I couldn't read that right because I was I was trying to figure out which you name that was. And that was that is not Yugi. And I'll, I do believe that is supposed to say Yugi, but I was actu I actually misread that last letter. You know Oh, I see. I think that's someone per pretty much made a typo based on how Yugi's name sounds. Th that's a completely excusable typo, but I was... I I'm not exactly in the best of... I'm not fully conscious. I'm, I'm a bit tired. But I'm, I'm, I'm going to bed soon. Don't worry. When Yugi's game makes it big, let's meet up and play it. I'm in. And dude, you don't just predict you'll be a success. You have to do the work too, dude. And so do I, honestly. So why am I not doing the work right now? <laughs> I need a break, seriously. I'm surprised I'm not behind yet. And now for anyone that is unaware, I am doing National Novel Writing Month. And the day started after midnight with me being behind. But because of how I've been, but, but miraculous, miraculous, well, now I'm no longer behind. That's, that's basically what I was going to say. I, I'm no longer behind. But I still have about a full day's worth of words to write. And I had to come up with them. And I'm just over here like, how? How? Okay, give me a second. Yes, me too. When you say big. Uh, don't worry, just remember your friends believe in you. Just be careful with those, uh... And be careful with that because... Yugi might have to deal with some failures first before they, before he makes it big. And now, honestly, I believe he does make it big eventually. I don't think this is confirmed or anything, but I do think that it's true. I have no reason to say that it is true, but that's in my head. That's my head cannon. Thanks, and I believe in you all too. Okay. Is that it? Well, this is another event that I'm not... Well, I think this is a different event. Yeah, I have to learn all the different event types in this game. <laughs> Since I'm so new and all that. And now I think I've almost gone through most of them. So, I, I think I'm almost done adjusting to the changes to this game. Since I last played, and now one of my accounts has been abandoned, and I was playing the game before GX World was released, and I had to pick and choose which game to pick with and stick with, and I decided to to um, get rid of Duel Links because I wasn't really playing it. And when I heard it was on Steam, I decided not to get it because I was afraid that I would be doing nothing else. Well, one fear is justified at the very least. I'm not doing much of anything else. Though I'm not behind in National Novel Writing Month either, so... 
playing Duel Links and doing National Not Writing Month is definitely possible, but I better I better work on some ideas. Okay, spin the ro robot in Duel. Okay, advance through the areas. Okay. This this seems very familiar. It's not familiar, I'm lying to myself. <laughs> oh god. Um. There's another card lottery. This seems to be very common. The card lotteries. I'm not complaining. I mean, it gives me keys. Who complains about keys? I sure don't. Okay, well, wh well, what's in the reward list this time? Which cards can I obtain? Okay. Interesting. I have plenty of ancient rules now. Okay, nothing too important, really. But I really love the keys. Yes, I'm still obsessed with keys. I'm not going to stop anytime soon. So just saying. Okay, well, give me a second. I'm going to end this video and return in a second. And because this, is what, this one is getting kind of long, and I think it would be nice to start off the next video with me apparently doing Mokuba. So give me a second to repair the next video. I'll see you guys then.